Well, it's a big welcome to you all for this year's Nullarbor Air Golf Championship Finals. We have a huge crowd in today and the competition should be fierce. First up, we have Bick, last year's champion and a multi-award winner in a host of air activities, including the recent Coffin Bay Air Macrame Finals. An ultra-competitive player. Next up, we have Kennedy. Kennedy, of course, is well known for her legendary dummy spits, and I have a feeling we might see one here today, Bill. And our final contender today is Clark, who's been training hard and has just jogged all the way from Penong and looks ready to give this a red-hot go this year. OK, so it's time for the air coin toss to see who starts, and... Oh, it looks like Kennedy's not happy with the result already. Whoa, this could be a sign of things to come. Oh no, Kennedy's the first to tee off, so that must have just been a practice dummy spit, Bill. She is a perfectionist, this one. Hang on, there appears to be a bit of sledging going on here, folks. There's no love lost between these two, Bill. Kennedy swings and misses. That's known as an air-air shot in air golf, of course. Oh, another swing and another miss. Not a good start here today. Meanwhile, Bick is lining up. She's certainly been around the traps a while and has a long list of titles to her name. Winner of the 1958 English Underwater Air Slipper Knitting Competition, the 1965 Timbuktu Air Bobsled for Seniors, and the 1974 Hobart Backwards Air Skipping Challenge. Oh, Kennedy's making a real hash of this one here today, Meanwhile, Bill. Meanwhile, Bick is still on the tee. She's taking her time, and it's a perfect start, straight down the fairway. She's looking very pleased with herself here, folks. Clark is the final competitor to tee off, and she is focused. You may remember that she was disqualified here last year after the unfortunate wombat incident. Whoa, what a slice. She's hit that sucker a country mile and it's a... No, not again. Meanwhile, Kennedy's still making her way up the fairway. What's the shot count, Bill? 29. And the hissy fit count? 22. She is on a roll. Clark, meanwhile, has made a good recovery and so has the dingo, you'll be pleased to know. And Kennedy's now 84 shots off the pace. Can someone contact the Guinness Book of Records? Bick has made her second shot and it's a ripper. And she's about to do her signature whistle jig to celebrate. She is on the green and a mere putt away from making this two in a row. Oh, and Kennedy has ramped up the tanty act. There's nothing that pushes her buttons more than a Bick whistle jig. And Clark realises she is in deep trouble here. Bick has it in the bag. Kennedy is not a happy camper. And so it seems a certainty, folks, as Bick lines up for this final putt. What the? Oh, it can't be. We have a streaker. Oh, my goodness me. Oh, can somebody censor that? <laughs> Sorry, folks. Well, I cannot believe it, folks, but it appears that our streaker is the Nullarbor Nymph, and she seems to be trying to put Bick off her game here. But Bick has nerves of steel and... Yes! Completes the putt and takes out the championship title and celebrates in true big style. Oh, that nymph is looking very dejected, Bill. That butt's seen better days. That's certainly a 70s model. Whoa, what's happening here? Kennedy looks like a woman on a mission. <coughs> and Bix overcome with the emotion of it all. What an incredible turn of events here today, ladies and gentlemen. And so Bick proudly holds aloft her Air Golf Championship trophy. Where's Clark disappeared to, Bill? Has anyone seen Clark? Well, that is a bit of a mystery. Colin! Oh, silly camera. Colin! Colin, look at this! Oh my God, what is that? No one's ever going to believe me. Colin! Colin, how do I zoom on this camera? Which button do I press? Oh, bother! Wake up, Colin! Useless man.